What's up guys, Trip649 here coming at you with part 19 of my Pokemon Heart Gold playthrough. And if you can tell by the audio, maybe you can't, I'm actually in a new place of recording. I'm in my brand new apartment, this is our first day. Uh, we just moved in this afternoon, it's 9.09pm right now. And uh, I don't have, tomorrow I don't have to get up too early for work, I'm uh, waiting for the cable guys to come tomorrow, so that's something I'm doing so I thought why not record a video I'm waiting for my friend to get back so we can go out to Buffalo Wild Wings and yeah so uh, first thing we're gonna do in Equitix City is come in here I just always start in here there's this rocket that's harassing one of the kimono girls he has a coughing I think you get like surf for this I think you do but I'm not you do in the original games I know for sure you get surf Look at this. Coughing is making it easy on us. And I'm going to try to be more consistent with this playthrough over the summer. I want to get pretty far. I probably want to, by the end of the summer, I kind of want to get to the 8th gym and stuff. So, we look, make him look a, like a villain. Ooh. He's going to be the lowest of the low. Right now we talk to her. But yeah, I want to be more consistent with the series. So, I want to post some more Pokemon White as well. And once you come here, this guy's gonna HMO3. Yep. Now I have a Crocona Water type Pokemon, but honestly, you don't want to teach your Crocona Frogator Surf. It's not a good move for him. It just doesn't. I mean, it's Frogator is such a good physical attacker. There's no need. What's it going for? Treasure hunting. Yes. This guy gives you the item finder. Dowsing machine in this game. It's on the bottom screen, you like tap it and it like, sends out a wave. I don't know. You can try it if you want. I'm not going to be using. I mean, the, the hidden items I see are the ones that are obvious, or the ones I get are obvious. Okay. Okay. Is it really Pokemon that big? I think they're talking about Ho Wo. -Oh. But I'm not entirely sure. Let let us. Yeah, let's go in here. The burn tower. Do I have any repels? I do. Good. I'm going to go around. So you come over here, and this is guy. Usain. Usain? Yeah, that's his name. He's a Suicune fanatic. He's gonna battle you a couple times throughout the game. He is obsessed with the middle or yeah, the middle one down there. Suicune. Here's the gym leader. Talk to him and once you unlock these three legendaries, then um, then you can move battle the gym leader. But it's your rival here, Silver. He wants to fight you. He wants to catch the legendary Pokemon or something like that. Here's Silver. Hopefully he goes a little better this time. He beat me the last time, so let's see it, Silver. I have the wrong Pokemon out. Shoot. Let's see it, my Silver. I have two bird Pokemon, flying Pokemon that can take you out. Oh my god. Look at this cheese. Please don't hit yourself, Crocona. Oh my god, me look. Oh my god. Hit him. Hit it. Yeah, let's go. That's a one hit KO. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. Sanchu and Crocodile. Bayleaf. Alright, Pidgeotto. Show me what you're good for. Use Gust against it. I mean, that Kenya or whatever, Sparrow or Spiro would do a lot better, honestly. But I want to get up a level. Gust. Yeah, his Pokemon aren't too high leveled here. Your rival's never really that hard in this game. Oh my god. This, this thing probably is synthesis. Cheese. I know your rival does not heal at all in this game, though, but I know Bayleaf has synthesis. But it only has five of them. 
That's going to use Reflect, which is okay. Oh no, two more gusts and we should have the drink. Let's get a high damage roll here. Uh, it's going to be three more. Two more after this. Yep, look at this. So we've got four more. I think we might speed this up. Yeah, let's speed this up. I just used the option to speed it up on the emulator. I know he's just going to use synthesis over and over again, so. Alright, now he's going to use magic. Okay, I see you. Bane. One more gust. Use synthesis again. Ooh, never mind. Don't use synthesis. Nice. Oh my god, look at that cheese. I'm taking can't putting Kenya out there. Look at this aerial ace. Holy crap. Aerial ace. Alright, now I can switch it back. Magnemite. Don't have anything for this. So we'll throw it out uh, Crocodile against it. The one thing you shouldn't. I don't have any ground attacks on my Sanctuary yet. This Magnemite's not too tough though. We'll use Water Gun. It's literally the only move I think I have. Nice. Look at that. Critical hit. Knocking it out. But a bang. And Zubat. We can knock that thing out with Sanchu. Actually, no, we probably should have just stayed in. It's going to confuse me and bite me and poison me. Zubat. And take me a couple hits to kill it, too. I think I'm just going to use Headbutt. Hey, look at that. Finally, we get lucky. Okay, one more headbutt. I think he's going easy on me. Oh my god. I mean, Supersonic has, I think, 55 accuracy. That thing hits at least 90% of the time. That's some cheese. Look at this cheese. Hit myself in confusion. Wing attack. Yeah, Zubat learned wing attack decently early, so it's definitely a choice. Look at this. Nonsense. Come on, Sanchu. There you go. Yeah. That's right, Silver. You, you, you can't hold me right now. You can't hold me. You can't hold me, boy. Hey, a lot of money. Um, I will actually be able to catch legendary Pokemon. We have time. Oh, look at that. We're just doing pretty on time. Alright, we got a, this trainer here. He's going to fight us. He's a fire breather. I don't know if he... I think he has a Magmar. Coughing. Never mind. He does not have a Magmar. I think I'm going to switch out. I have Soda Wodo with... Just because I want a little bit more power if I my guy's getting knocked out. Okay, assurance. And remember, coughing is more physically defensive, so you can use a special attack and it dominates him. Get my shell bell. Cool. Tackle attack. And coughing's out. Hopefully he has a magma. This seems to give out good experience. Let's see, this is the worst thing about Shell though. It's so slow to I don't know why they have such a effect after turn effect. Oh we'll just stay in. Let's get Crocodile to level twenty five to match the gym leader's level twenty five. Coughings give up pretty good experience, so this is nice. Wow, I did a lot of damage. Smog, don't poison, don't poison. Oh my god. Look at this. Cheese. Look, Chris Smooth there. Cheese. Cheese. And I get the critical hit on the last little turn there. After turn effects. Level 25, though. Let's go, boy. 
Hey, a Growlithe. I guess Sanshu can give it a try. I probably could have switched out into Sudowoodo. Hey, we got Ned Stark here. Let's try to roll out. Hey, I'm faster. See, I was thinking about catching a Growlithe. But the thing is, don't burn. The thing is, I don't, you don't get a Firestone for so late in the game. It sucks. So it's really hard to train a Growlithe when it's at like level 45. It's just so weak. Oh, I evolve level 22? I do! Look at this! Excitement! Sandshrew! We didn't have him very long, but we're going to enjoy our Sand Slash. I don't think I've ever used a Sand Slash in this game. I don't know if I've ever used one, period. Do we use... Look at that! We learned Crush Claw? What? Let's go, dude! 75, 95? What do I get rid of? I think Headbutt's better. Personally. I think Crush Cow looks cooler though. Screw it. Let's get rid of Headbutt. <clears throat> Five more damage. And it can lower the defense. Crush Claw's cooler. You don't see a lot of Pokemon with Crush Claw on them. It's one of those rare moves. Look at Sandshrew, he looks, or Sand Slash, it looks so cool. Hey, look at that. You know what, I'm going to be honest. When I shut down the game last time after the part I recorded, the game, like, crashed. I was, like, I was really worried. It turned all black, and I didn't really turn it back on and test it. So I was really up, like, where I'm a crap, and I just lose, lose my save file. Would have been grinding to get back here. This guy has the Magmar. No, he has a Charmeleon. Look at that. That's a cool Pokemon. Let's try our Sand Slash's Crush Claw. Look at that cool move. Look at that power. Oh, look at that. I'm dead. Look at that move. Look at that power. Look at look at I'm dead. Thank you, Charmeleon. Thank you. This thing's dangerous. Dragon Rage is really dangerous early on. Gyarados, that's why if you get a Gyarados at level 20, it gets Dragon Rage or something. Or 22 or something like that. Not at level 20, but 22. It's freaking powerful. That Dragon Rage on that. Charmeleon, powerful. 40 hit points this early on. Knocks basically everything out in two hits. Let's see what we battle these two guys to get. Do I have Rock Smash? Alright, yes. Curse is an HM slave. Wow, that was worth it. I guess we could put on our dowsing machine. Let's break him. Break on me. Is there anything right here? There must be something right here. There has to be. What a waste of time. Oh, one more repel. And I think I'm thinking about catching a Magmar, but I'm not sure. So if you want to leave some input, give me a comment in the video. Tell me if I should catch a Magmar or a Coughing. I think those are the two main things in here. Come down here, activate these threes event. So now that you can meet these in the wild, not Suicune, you can't meet Suicune in the wild. But you, uh, Raikunente will randomly just spawn into your area, and if you go into the grass, you'll meet him. That's the only way to like. And then they'll, there's those running legendaries, so they'll run away once they um, once you meet them. So you have to just get one chance at them. It's kind of annoying, but whatever. Can you go back there? No. Frick. Well, this is you come back here with strength and stuff and. Get yourself an item, looks like. But that is the burnt tower. Now we can move on to bigger and better things. Like the gym. That's basically all we have left to do in this city. Nothing over here. Nope. You can go to the Pokemon if you want. Focus center, but here's the gym. 
next time we'll be, we'll be yeah wow that was that was some pretty bad language right there <laughs> next time we'll be in the fourth gym taking on morty and his ghost types hope you all enjoy see you next time